another day in paradise. It's looking pretty good. There's definitely a bit of wind about. You can see from all these trees rustling around. Oh, there's a sneak peek at some of the lures. All of those three are new. Well, for me, two of them are brand new. Unreleased, one of them is new for me. Heading into the danger zone. Uh-oh. Good enough. Goodbye, boat ramp and rope swing. Really cool rope swing just there, but it is definitely windy this morning. It is already blowing 10 knots and it's only meant to get much, much windier. So it is gonna be a really, really challenging day fishing. Anytime that you're fishing with lures like we are, it's gonna be really tough when there's a lot of wind. The positive is that there should be very, very minimal people out today. It is a Sunday, but there's rain forecasted, there's strong winds. So that should keep a lot of the weekend warriors off the water. So my plan for today is to fish some new areas, new bridges. There's two bridges in mind which I want to fish. And on the way up, it's about a three kilometer pedal. So on the way up, I'm also going to be sounding for some deep holes, which we'll drop some lures into if we find any. So that's a little bit of the game plan, but I'm really excited to show you some of these lures which I'm working with today because they're unreleased. Unreleased lures. I'm definitely not the first person to use these lures, but in my mind, I'm going to tell myself that just so I feel more special. My nose is running. It is not, I mean, it's actually pretty cold this morning. I'm not going to lie. I'm cold. Well, we've just arrived at the bridge, as you can see. And that's a big shame, man. That boat just blasted it, went straight through it. Usually, if you're going to get some big fish, it's when there's no traffic, no nothing, no noise. But unfortunately, we've had someone drive through here, which could spook the fish. There are fences, but I was going to say, I could launch the kayak right here. You just can't access it. Ooh, look at that. Some life on the side scan there, some fish on the bottom. So the good thing is, is that there does seem to be a fair bit of life around this bridge, so I'm pretty happy with where we picked. Now let's get a look at these lures. By now, these lures should be released, and if not, I'm in a world of trouble, but here's a little look at them right here. They are the TT Vibes. They are soft vibes, so I love using soft vibes. Been using a heap of them recently. That's a little bit of the plan. And this is actually a new combo for me as well. Three to six kilo rod, 2,500 size reel. So a really good plastic setup. That's what we're gonna be using it for. I just saw a cormorant on this pylon, so that's a good sign. I tried to Google this bridge and people fishing at this bridge and I could find absolutely nothing. So I know nothing about this bridge. I know nothing about what's around here. Today is completely an explore mission. That lure looks pretty good though. Can't believe we haven't got any little fish yet. There's a lot of life down there. They're obviously just not feeding. I reckon if we're gonna get any, it's gonna be on the small bait. We're gonna try this little vibe on every single one of these pillars, and then we're gonna go for a move again. Try here. Starting to run out of pylons. There we go. Oh, you're kidding. <laughs> That felt decent. There we go, another fish. Oh, that feels decent. I think that's a good flathead, actually. <laughs> Flatty? Oh, is that a little Jew? It is a little tiny Jewy. They are here. That is epic. On that brand new little vibe, the reason they weren't hitting the bigger lures is because obviously some of them are really, really small. Well, in my book, it doesn't matter how big these things are because any little Jew is an epic fish. We'll let him go. See you, mate. Oh, that is sick. <laughs> I was starting to lose a lot of hope in this spot. I could see the fish down there, but I'm thinking that that boat which flew through here earlier spooked a lot of them. So hopefully they're starting to come back on the bite now. It'd be funny if we hooked a real big one on this tiny little light gear. Well, it'd be funny for about a minute, then we'll get smoked. Man, it is a Sunday today. It is a Sunday and there is not one other person fishing this area. So. That's why I love doing stuff like this, exploring completely new spots which aren't really on Google at all. Like, I couldn't find anything about this bridge. If they're feeding on small bait, then small lures will do the trick. I have a couple more casts here. One cast over this side, and then we'll go for a little bit of a move. See if we can get one to eat. Oh, sugar. There we go. That's another fish. First cast with a slightly bigger vibe. And we've got a nice flathead. I reckon that boat definitely spooked some of the fish which were in the area. Very quality flatty on that vibe. Flatty's off. Once again, 
Oh, first cast with that slightly bigger vibe. There he is there, not a bad little flatty at all. Second fish of the day. Ouch, I'll let you go, mate. A nice flatty. Off you go. Well, we haven't been using these lures for too long now, and we've already caught a couple of nice little fish. Really good little lure. Has a nice finish. A really nice steady vibe. Really nice shimmy. So I'm gonna leave this bridge behind for now. I'm gonna go fish some deep holes. We'll probably end up coming back to here a little bit later on, but for now we might as well do a little bit of exploring before the wind shoots all the way up. We're gonna try this other little bridge. It's not very deep there, but it's worth a crack. This spot is a no-go, man. No-go. It is not deep. There is not a lot of bait. It was a mistake coming here. We found some fish. That bridge was an absolute bust, but we're on our way back down to the other one. As you can see, and I've just came across a really nice rock bar with some fish sitting on the bottom of it. So that looks exciting, to say the least. Wonder what these are. See on the sounder there, some fish scattered along the bottom, six meters deep. We've got this little vibe. We're just gonna throw that and drop it in their faces. Going out. So the rock bar is to the right over here, so I'm gonna cast right along that drop. No nibs on the vibe. Try the paddle tail. And if this is no good, we'll try a little tiny vibe. There we go. That's a decent fish. Failed him pluck that. It's gotta be a good flatty, I reckon. Is that a good flatty? Cracking flatty. Oh, herring. That's what's down there. There's a little herring in his gob. A tiny little herring, I think that's what that is. Came out of this fella. <laughs> that's a really nice flatty though. We'll let him go. That is almost a picture perfect representation. Same body shape. If it was white, I actually do have a white one. If it was white, it would look the exact same. Well, I think that's gonna do us for this little session, but it's definitely not the end of the video. In a couple days time when this weather clears, I'm gonna head back out and hopefully find some more good fish on these lures. Well, morning number two. We are back out here using the same lures as last time. We've got those new vibes, those new paddle tails. And today, hopefully we can have a little bit more success. I'm fishing a little bit more of a familiar area for me. I'm gonna head up to this bridge where I know that there's some fish sitting. so. Hopefully we can get one of the bigger ones to eat. There's been plenty of little ones here. I know there's big ones here, but I've just got to get them. That guy right there just lost one, so that's a good sign. Gonna get straight into it this morning, no messing around. Here's a little look at the lure we're gonna start off with. It's pretty snaggy around here, so I'm gonna use this paddle tail. Obviously plastics cost less than vibes, so we'll throw this around these bridge pylons, see if we can locate any fish. Might take us a while to find out where they're sitting, but hopefully we can. There's a few down there, but it's not feeding yet. Try the little vibe. Switch up the profile a bit. Come on, fishers. Where are ya? There we go. There we go, on the vibe. On the vibe. Oh, he got off. I'm just gonna try vibe right next to these pylons. I can see him on the side scan. They're pretty much hugging this massive bit of structure. There we go. That's a good one. On the little vibe. There we go. Little fella. Very little fella. But it's the first one. I want to show you guys that vibe, but it is completely tangled up. But that was the one which did it. The little white, white bait imitation. He's only small, but with how hard they've been to get to bite this morning, we will take him. Nice little Dewey. There's more down there, so hopefully we can get him to eat. Well, the paddle tails have not been working at all so far, but we convinced one on the tiny little vibe. He was just right down below all this bait. You can see all the bait on the sounder. And there's a couple marks below it. Get another cast back out. I'm pretty much vertical jigging. There's a lot of rain about. I would like to be casting up into here, but obviously I can't get all the cameras wet. I destroy all my gear. Another cast. That's the cast. We want to get it as close to these pylons as we can. That's where the majority are sitting. Don't know if you can see, there's some bigger marks right up amongst them. Well, I knew how trying these conditions would have been. I 
Might not have came out today, but we're here anyway, so let's keep persisting. The rain is just not stopping. Put the paddle tail away again. Absolutely non-stop drizzle. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool being tucked away under this bridge while it's raining. We'll throw the vibe down again. The vibe's been the winner so far. There we go. We got one. That's a better one, I think. A little bit better, maybe. On the vibe once again. Yeah, he's a little bit better. A little bit. Yeah, not bad. Definitely a little bit better. Once again on the vibe, they're not touching the paddle tails at all. Only on the vibes. Definitely still no monster, but that is a nice little fish on the vibe. Slightly bigger than that first one, so pretty happy to get him. Vibes out. We'll let him go. See you, buddy. Cool. He was actually on the pile on over, so... We'll go back there. Definitely sounded up a few more with him, so we'll see if they eat this bad boy and cast it up right alongside the pylon. Rain's finally subsided a little bit. It only takes one eat. That's what I keep trying to tell myself. It only takes one fish. Pretty much change the whole day. Man, this is tough, tough fishing. It is very, very quiet. I'm not sure how much longer we're going to spend out here. All right, everyone. I think the rain is going to beat me today. We still managed two nice little dewfish, but overall the fishing was really, really tough. We put in a couple of hours this morning, actually three hours this morning for the two little fish, and it's been raining almost the whole time. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like on this one, comment some suggestions down below, and I'll see you in the next video.